Welcome to necklace sorting. I have like about, I think over a thousand necklaces to sort. So I'm gonna do these into short, about 10 minute segments and we'll see how many we can sort within those 10 minutes. So this is black, this is going into the black area. And our next one here is another gorgeous black. You have a little bit of your a stone on the earrings and this is your stone. I believe these do float, which makes it fun. So that will also go in her black. Our black area, this one is pretty, ooh, this is a vintage. So this is brass, cute little brass earrings. And then your black encircled. I love how these kind of float. There's a lot of movement to this one. So this is brass. And here is a rose gold. So we don't have that many rose gold. Those are cute for earrings and hoops. This one is a long pendant. Again, it has that movement to it. So rose gold. I usually just put the rose gold in with all of the gold. So pretty much goes in the same section. And here's this one as well. This is also a rose gold along with that beautiful sparkly medallion. You know, I make these films to calm people down and to kind of just provide you a chance if it's late at night and you just can't sleep to have something to kind of just de-stress your brain. And last night, I literally, okay, this is a black. In the black, cute little chains on the bottom. I literally watched my own video last night. I could not sleep. It was awful. It was like hours and hours of just laying in bed. And I finally did pull up my video and watched it. And shortly after that, I fell asleep. But I thought it was kind of funny that I literally watched my own video to calm myself. Here's a brass, little kind of a hexagon with Eora Fringy on the bottom of that one. And this will be an ongoing series because I have so many to sort. So check back if you can't sleep or you just wanna calm yourself. Cute blue, look at that, the midnight blue with your little floating, it does these, no, these are locked into place but it has that beautiful kind of like an airy or lightweight design to it. Blue will go over there. So check back because I'll be posting these pretty often until we get to the end of our necklaces. And here's your cute silver with the word hope on it. That one is cute, I love that one. And then once we're done with our necklaces, we'll move on to earrings and then bracelets. And then we might go back to necklaces again. By then I might have more to sort. Cute red earrings with your red statement necklace. I think yesterday we only found one red or maybe two. Ooh, this one's really pretty. I'm really into pearls right now. You have your gold setting with your pearl and look at that. A little bit of your pearl accent in between. That one is stunning. If you want to purchase one of these, you're welcome to. Just um, send me a screenshot on my Facebook page, those who follow me on Facebook. And I will let you know if it's still available. I'm not putting numbers to these because we're just sorting today. These are cute. So you have your little yellow shell earrings with your wooden accent. Sometimes it's fun to just purchase the, the necklace set for the earrings. Cute, right? The yellow. Go into the yellow category. And here's a pink. This one has a little fringe on it. Hot pink pearl with your drop down bling. Look how gorgeous that one is. Pink section. We're gonna put the pink there today. And this is a black metal. You have your black chain. This is a man's urban or necklace. Gorgeous chain on that one. That will go into our black section. Here's a red, so you have your beautiful red pearl. This is a medium, it's not super long. I wonder if you could actually wear it as a double. Ooh, that would be such a cute choker with your floating red pearl. Red section. This is a mixed colorway. You have your brown with your black. I think I'll put this in the multi area because it's not brown or black. It's kind of a combination of both. So multi, we'll go ahead and go right there. This one's beautiful. You have a little bit of a, no, that's just a flat black. You do have a shimmer in this one though. Look, <gasps> gorgeous. This will go into the black category. Hot pinky pink. Those of you that love your bright pink, you have your translucent and your opaque and then solid beads on that one. So pink. Ooh, this one I think is so much fun. This one is super fun. You have your red crackle stone earring, but look at the scalloped. No, I'm gonna move pink just a bit so I can show you. Some of these on the black just look so pretty together with your little red. 
And then we have, oh, this one's super fun. So this one is your, look at the texture on that one, the hardware. You have your gray cord with a little bit of silver floating throughout. That will go in our silver category. Here's a beautiful purple pearl. So this is a fun one. This is actually a tie ribbon, so it does tie around your neck. And then it has that stunning pearls in the purple tone. Purple will go to the side. A gold, a short gold. Now I'm not sure if this is a choker. It might sit slightly above the collar line, but that will go into our gold. And then here we have a silver. Look at the hoops on that one. Isn't that pretty? Just all of the interlocking hoops. A copper. Oh, this one's super cute. You have your dainty little copper earrings. And look, the tiniest dainty pendant. If you love your dainties, that one is so cute. And we'll put copper over to the side. Oh, we have a green. So yesterday we didn't even have any green. Look at this beautiful pearl in the green. And then you have your little accent bead. That one's pretty. It's so much fun going through these. These are vintage and go back, some of these maybe go back five years when I first started paparazzi. Here's your brown with your purple. So that will go into the purple. And it's so much fun to look at these. Oh, I love this one. This is such a good one. So this is your brown. And you have your cute little circle earrings in the brown. This is a pull cord, so you can turn it into a long or a short. Love the neutral shade of brown. Here's another black, and this is a man. You can see the silver tag on that. Look at that chain, isn't it gorgeous? Look at those cute little free earrings. And this is a multi or iridescent. Look how pretty, so gorgeous. I love that pastel iridescent, so that goes in our multi. Here's another hot pink, pinky pink. Silver and pink on that one. This is a great, and is this our first duplicate? Okay, so we found our first duplicate. We did see one of these yesterday, which is the entire reason why I'm sorting to see if we do have duplicates. This one's fun. This is a Halloween, or not a Halloween, more of like an autumn or festival. But like, look at the colors, right? Candy corn, oh my goodness. Or it could be a fun summer set. Isn't that so cute? I love this style, I love the seed bead. This one is definitely going into our multi-category. Here's a beautiful blue. You have that blue, is that blue lapis, the stone on that one? I think that one's pretty and that will go into our blue category. This one is so stunning. So you have your little earrings and it looks like this one is missing an earring. So either I can replace it by finding another, which I might do because this is such a stunning necklace. I love the bead on this. I think it's so much fun. So I'm gonna put that to the side and see if I can actually repair it. Cause it's just that tiny little free earring, which we do see a lot of those. So that would be an easy replacement. Oh, this one's gorgeous. So there's your little earrings and the white. Look at this. This is your multicolor in the flowers. Isn't that so pretty? You have all of the different shades and then your flower and the Y shape drop down, which I love. I love it when it creates that Y shape with a drop down. So that's a multi. Here's a green and gray combo. Look at that. You have your green with the gray. Fun fringe. And this one, I am... I'm going to go ahead and put this in the green category because the gray is such a, a neutral shade. The earrings are green, so that will go into our gray. This is gorgeous. Look at this color. It's this beautiful. Oh, these are cute too. They're a little bit more thicker. This is that coral, kind of a peachy mother of pearl shell. And I love the shimmer on that. So this one will go into our orange category. Look at this fun urban. So this is a man's urban adjustable i believe oh no it does have a little beaded closure so this one has the pottery beads with your woven little silver accent this i'm going to go ahead and put in the black category here's a red one you have your fringe earring and look at the size of this you also have a spark which you don't often see mixed together with a crackle stone this is long and is going into the red category Here's a double layer. That's a cute brass. I love the daintiness of this. This one, look at those cute little free earrings. Definitely in the brass category. Here's a fun, happy necklace. See how happy they're, it's even smiling at you. So this is a purple 
and your double layer going in the purple category. This one's gorgeous. I know I do have more of these. So this will go back in its home in the green area. But look at that with your little sparkles on that one. Here's the purple. You have your cute little purple earrings and your statement purple category. This one is fun. This is a vintage. You have your little sparkles in the black. So this is going in our black category. It's your key. Nice size on that one. Came across quite a few blacks this time. This is your gray pearl and it goes down into your layered gray with your little clusters. A beautiful long one. Gray category. And another black. Your fringe on there. It goes down into your black with your lanyard. So this is cute. It's actually a lanyard. We don't have that many of the lanyard. And here's another black. Look at this one. This is the acrylic ice. It looks like ice or diamonds. And that is your black setting on that one. Here's another brass. This one here has your little brass pearl and your layered brass, two tones, brass and pearl. And that's where we're going to end on this one. So join me in part two, actually join me in part three and we'll just continue. So bye until next time.